All right, some exciting news. An international team of astronauts blasting into orbit today on their way to the International Space Station. As the race for space heats up once again, with China and India making their own efforts to explore the moon. Fox News correspondent Jonathan Sari has that story. The Dragon spacecraft Endurance is in low Earth orbit with four astronauts on board. It's scheduled to dock with the International Space Station on Sunday. It launched atop a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket that lit up the night sky as it lifted off from NASA's Kennedy Space Center at 327 in the morning. A toy sloth picked by the children of Danish astronaut Andreas Mogensen serves as the mission zero gravity indicator. The Crew 7 mission also includes a Russian cosmonaut, Japanese astronaut, and is under the command of American astronaut Jasmine Mobelli. We may have four crew members on board from four different nations, Denmark, Japan, Russia, and the USA, but we're a united team with a common mission. This morning's launch comes just days after India successfully landed a space probe near the moon's south pole. Russia failed at a similar attempt last weekend. China plans to put humans on the lunar south pole by the end of the decade. The discovery of ice there and the potential for other minerals is driving a new space race. Could space turn out to be a dud? Sure. But it could also turn out to be the next great land grab. And that's why space is important. Professor Jay Zagorski of the Boston University Questrom School of Business says the U.S. still leads in space, but the sector is not growing as rapidly as the rest of the economy, which could help China eventually realize its dream of matching or surpassing the U.S. in space by the middle of this century. At Kennedy Space Center, Jonathan Seri, Fox News.